friends, it's me. And today we are back at it again because I want to show you guys what I got myself for Christmas. Does that sound bad? Are you not supposed to do that? I feel like this year I shopped as much for myself as I did for everyone. No, that's a lie. I bought a lot of things for myself. I did most of my Christmas shopping online this year. I feel like it's just so easy. It's like I'm buying somebody a gift. Oh, but I like this shirt, which happens to be on the same site. And I need $75 to get free shipping. So the never ending cycle. And I got some of these things on Black Friday and I was gonna make a Black Friday video and then days pass and then weeks pass and now almost a month. And the stuff has been sitting in my room waiting to be made a video on. I was like, I'm not taking out any of this stuff until I make a video on it. So we're just gonna get right into the goods. So I know it's sponsored, but this one may as well be a gift to myself. It's a Kenzie IPL device for laser hair removal. Y'all see these legs? I know they ashy AF and haven't seen the sun in weeks, but I also haven't shaved in weeks. The only rug I see is the one on the floor. But yeah, this is really cool. Like I've been doing my laser hair removal at home and it's so easy. It saves so much time. Like I hate shaving. You know, if I added up all the time I've wasted shaving in my life, I've probably wasted a few days or weeks. And ain't nobody got time for that. So here's what the device looks like and the power cord goes in and then this is where the light comes out of. And you can use this on your face, your body. Like I used to go to the salon and get laser treatment. It would take so long. First I would have to drive like 30 minutes and then do my treatment, which is kind of awkward. And then drive back, like it's such a waste of time. Wasting time I don't have. That's why I'm up at 4 a.m. recording this video. Also I travel a lot and I don't always have time to be shaving. Most of the time I even forget my razor. It just makes your life so much easier because it's like one less thing to worry about. It's like I used to shave my legs every few days and now I shave them every few weeks. I'm gonna show you how simple this is. All you gotta do is plug it in, turn it on, then we're gonna select our level. So I'm pressing the green button on the back and you can adjust the level on how high you want the setting. I'm gonna do level five. It's definitely gonna be the most effective. And then we're just gonna it doesn't hurt or anything. If anything, it's just like a warm feeling. IPL uses a broad spectrum of visible light wavelengths that work more like a beam from a torch covering broader areas of the skin. Laser hair removal uses actual laser technology that targets specific small controlled areas of the skin. I love how easy Kenzie is to use. It's super efficient, it's reliable, safe, convenient. All you gotta do is plug it in, press the button, easy peasy. Check out the link in the description below to get your Kenzie today. It's normally $200. $29, but if you use code WOLF, you get $30 off. So go to KENZZI.com and stop wasting time shaving. So I went to YSL on Black Friday. You know it's crazy for a lot of people. Like I always like to just see it. I want to see the craziness. Just making sure I haven't died down. But people still be wild. So I went to YSL and I got a bag. And this just so happened to be on sale on Black Friday. You would think designer stores don't really have sales. And that's true. They don't really. But this was on sale for 40% off. And I was like oh my god. This is so beautiful. Like can we take a moment to appreciate it? needs to focus so you guys can see how beautiful it is because it's got like baguette diamonds, crystals, whatever you want to call them. All I know is they ain't real. I wanted like an evening bag with silver hardware because I just don't have any bags with silver hardware. And this was just a velvet. It looks black, right? But it's not black. It's like a really dark green and you can kind of tell with the leather. So I thought it was just very unique. I've never seen anything like it. And oh, it's just so pretty. It's just so blingy. Mm. And you open it up, it's got a strap. It passed the phone test. So, you know, when I have an evening bag, all I need it to fit is my phone, my card, my ID, and my chapstick or lip gloss or whatever is on my lips that night. I already have like a couple YSL bags like this, but they're boring and I always wanted one with a tassel. I don't know, I feel like they're expensive. They go on sale anyway, so I just wanna wait for the sale. And very cute, very pretty, very blingy, and 40% off. I felt like that was a good deal. Finally, I finally did a video on this now I can wear it. This is kind of weird, but every year I always find myself going into an Aeropostale, Aeropostale, Aeropostale store for Black Friday. They have 
have some cute clothes. I call them video clothes. Like, you know, most of my clothes are just for when I'm recording. They, like, I don't wear them in real life. Like, you see me in real life 99.5% of the time. I'm in leggings, the same black leggings. I mean, even when I'm recording, I'm wearing those too. Most of the time, I'm in leggings. And then I'm in, like, my merch. I literally live in my merch. Aeropostale has a lot of really comfy, like, cute, cheap clothes. And it's like, they're marked as a lot. These say $32 for, like, the soft of the soft like that felt material every year is tradition I must buy a pair of festive leggings and these ones just so happen to be like the soft joggers but do they have pockets no does that matter when they're 70% off so these are pretty cheap everything I got was pretty cheap I got a ton of stuff I took out a lot of stuff from the bag all my clothes are dirty I needed clothes and I wore some of it so those are long lost and gone but I feel like oh these would be so perfect when it's cold these are the booty leggings this makes you look good and soft boys love them excuse my rolled up dress these are very cute oh my god they're so soft next up i know this is so boring it's literally a black and white striped shirt but it's really soft and then i got matching shorts with it so like most of the store was 70 percent off or at least i go for the stuff that's like 70 percent off and just like little cute shorts these are 29 dollars and then 70 percent off that is like less than 10 dollars all right all right well these don't even match i got these thought i would wear them as like a, a pj set no whatever i'll wear it but i thought they were a set but apparently not so i had to reach 100 dollars before I got a free blanket which I gave to my dog so I just bought a ton of like fuzzy socks you can't go wrong with these these are like the best have you heard of somebody having too many socks that's illegal oh I love fuzzy socks so basically when I went I got a ton of these shirts because they're really soft and they're really good for layering I live in Vegas now so it's very 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 cold in the winter I haven't had a real winter in a very long time East Coast be like hold my hot cocoa not but for real though, 40 degrees I'm dying and I was like panicking because it's like like, I have to wear layers on layers and layers and I'm not used to that okay this is literally so heavy it weighs like 20 pounds I'm not even kidding so this is a jacket sorry it's a cardigan there's a difference so I wanted like a really chunky knitted cardigan this is by I love mr. mitten I'm not even kidding this weighs at least 10 pounds at least look at this like dang boy she thick so it's just like a very 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 warm cardigan again. Woo! Is this what Ed Sheeran said when he said, I'm in love with the shape of you? This is a very lovable shape. Oh, it's so warm. Wear this in my sugar daddy's log cabin. Just kidding, I'm my sugar daddy. Like, I was not expecting it to be, like, this big and comfy. But I do think it was kind of a ripoff. I mean, their cardigans are a bit pricey. But, I mean, it's like you buy a Gucci cardigan for, like, $1,500, $2,000. And it ain't nothing special about, like, the material or quality of it. It just got some G's on it. Next up, these were an impulse buy. I went to Nordstrom on Black Friday and... Wow. I like put it on my knee and it kicked. <laughs> That reflex. Oh, these smell so dang. I haven't even worn them yet. All right, so I have been looking at these rain boots for a long time now. Like every time I would go into Nordstrom, I would like look at them and be like, mm, mm, mm. no, I don't need them. And then when it starts raining, I'm like, I need a rain boot. Also, these were expensive. They were a thousand dollars, but they were forty percent off. Oh, did I mention their Dior? I know this is like the least Dior looking item I've ever seen, and it says Christian Dior Paris and like. CD on the back of it, but they were on sale. I needed a rain boot I wanted these but in black the black ones did not go on sale only the green But I'm like I have my Doc Martens, so I'll literally never wear another boot But I feel like I may wear them so I got them and my mom was like they're cute So I was like, okay mother. I will buy them. I haven't worn them yet But I think I think I will especially if it rains if it rains It's like I have a rain boot. Also, this is a very expensive piece of rubber. Yay. Okay, so these dresses I I got that I am obsessed with. I haven't worn them yet, but they are so beautiful and I can't wait to wear them. So I got both of these from Dolls Kill. And this one, it has a hook on it because I just got it altered. I love this dress. It's so beautiful and so goth. And look at these sleeves. Just wait till you see it on. So I have to get the waist altered. I have to literally get the waist altered for every single thing I buy that I seriously want to wear. It's a struggle, but it's like I want my stuff to look good and actually fit me. So I got to do that. Oh my God. Aww. 
This is like the perfect dress. I feel like it's a little short, so I have to wear shorts under it, but I love these sleeves. These sleeves are, oh my God, everything. I wish everything I owned had sleeves like this. This was really annoying to get into though because it's all buttons and I hate doing buttons. I don't know if you can see it, but there's like chiffon and then there's a tie right here that you can tie into a bow. Very dark Sakura. And here's the other one, which is a black velvet. It's very similar and it's got like lace on the sleeves. I love these freaking, I don't know what to call it, like statement sleeves, like sleeves that got some going on. Like, like look at this detail. It's just so beautiful. Fashion Nova could never. And it has like this little cutout. So this one, where's the bow? It has a bow that attaches right here, like a pin. And it just kind of makes the whole entire thing, but I don't know where it is. Another thing I got is this Skirt. And I'm so excited to wear this. I don't have anything like it. It's like a pleated skirt It has like some leather details all over it. It's got lace on the bottom of this Hello, and like a built-in belt. It's just so anime. I love it. Oh my god. Is this skirt real? Have you seen something so freaking adorable? Ugh, the lace. I feel like the problem is the waist is a little big I'm not sure if it's supposed to like sit lower, but I like my skirts short because it'll make your legs look longer but I'm I'm obsessed with this. Ooh. And then this little Christmas dress, which I regret buying because it's like so I feel cheaply made. But instead of snowflakes, it has skulls. It's skull flakes. This is what it looks like when it snows in hell. I feel like these dresses used to be really popular, not so much anymore. I probably need to wear like a belt with it or like get a cinch. I don't know. I guess it's kind of cute from far away until you notice this. This is a, a design fail right here. You see how the seam is just cut between the skirt part and the top? It doesn't match up. They messed it up. All they had to do was move this part over here and then they connect. So I wore that and even my boyfriend noticed. So that's how you know it's bad when a guy notices these things. I got these festive little sleeve shorts, which like who, who built like this? Like what kind of shape is this for shorts? And I can tell you right now, they fit how they look. They don't fit that well. They fit really bad. There's, there's a lot of cheek, but not in a good way. I mean, I'm sleeping in them. It doesn't matter. Okay, so another little splurge thing I did was from Channel, my favorite TV show. These are always, 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 always sold out. I feel like I got really lucky that I asked to see the earrings and they had these ones in stock. These are like the influencer earrings. <laughs> I'm gonna go to an influencer event and I'm going to buy these. The Chanel earrings. Wow, let's do it this way. Oh my God, they're so pretty. They got like rhinestones bedazzled in them. Let me eat my earrings off for a sec. It's funny because these are like so pricey for some dang costume jewelry. Like the quality is like something you would get from Claire's. You would have expected more from Chanel, right? Wrong. I hope I'm wearing these right, but look how stupid and extra they look. I love it. I'm wearing these wrong, aren't I? And especially on my camera, like it looks weird. <laughs> what do you think? Like? Hey, I wanna know. Anyways, that's all for today. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Did you guys spoil yourself? Or what did you get? Let me know in the comments below. If you guys enjoyed this video, make sure to hit that like button and the face. And make sure you turn on notifications so you know when I upload. Click, click, and subscribe to my channel. I love you guys so much. Thanks for watching. Bye guys.